Kika is a 10 to 20 minute color matching game for two to four players, aged four and up. There are many ways to play Kika. This video will demonstrate a simple two player game using two of the seven rule cards. Let's begin. Open the box and set aside the four color cards. Separate the rule cards into two sets, English and Japanese, and just use one of them. Also set aside the triangle tokens. Choose the random rule card and the chain rule card and set them on the table. Place all the tiles face down. These are the supply tiles. Arrange the supply tiles in a circle around the playing area. Decide who will be the first player. As part of setup, the first player will take any one tile from the supply and place it face up in the middle of the playing area. Now the first player takes their turn. First, they choose any one tile from the supply. Then they place it face up next to any tile in the plane area. This is a color matching game, so matching the colors will get you points. Count the number of triangles in a group next to and of the same color as the tile you placed. Remember, you never count the tile you placed. The tile placed has a purple triangle and it was placed next to one purple triangle. Therefore, they score one point. Keeping track of your score is really easy. For every point you score, take any one supply tile and place it in front of you face up. That is the end of their turn. The second player takes a tile. It also has a purple triangle. They place it next to the two purple triangles already in the plane area. Therefore, they score two points. They then take any two tiles from the supply and place them in front of them face up. And that is the end of their turn. The first player then takes another tile. It matches two colors in the plane area. However, the chain rule card states that you only count one group. Naturally, they choose the larger group which has three triangles and they score three points. The second player takes another tile from the supply and places it next to two blue triangles and scores two points. Did you know that the random rule card states that you can take tiles from the supply or from the tiles in front of you? The first player does just that. Not wanting to risk not getting a blue or purple triangle, they take one of their tiles. They place it next to three blue triangles and score three points. Since they played one of their tiles, they only increase their score by two points from four to six. The second player takes their turn and scores four points. The first player scores four points too. You will see how the players are trying to close the groups as to prevent the other player from taking more points on their turn. Now that the groups are closed, it might be worth taking a random tile. The second player does just that and scores one point. The first player also does that, but draws a blank tile. Blank tiles do not match any color, even other blank tiles. They score no points. Play continues until all the tiles have been taken and placed. If the tiles run out during scoring, you don't get those points. Now that the game has ended, players count their tiles. The player with the most tiles wins. In the case of a draw, play again. Try out other rule cards when you're ready for more. Just remember to include the rule cards marked with a star. There are over 972 possible ways to play Kika. Enjoy!